I'm Melissa Vega with your News 4 Snapshot. A San Antonio man is behind bars accused of robbing a person at gunpoint by using Cash App. According to investigators, Kian Criddle met the victim through social media and then the two met up in person. He's accused of getting in the victim's car, pulling out a gun and demanding the victim send him money on the banking app. Police say he then took the victim's phone and took off running. He was identified in a photo lineup, arrested and charged with aggravated robbery. One in every 10 Americans who use Adderall may be affected by the ongoing shortage. That's according to a new study using data from the health platform Truveta, and that's despite the prescription rate for Adderall and similar ADHD treating drugs falling 11% from late 2022 to 2023. The FDA says there was an increase in demand last summer as well as delays, and that's according to every Everything factoring into that ongoing shortage. And April Fool's Day is over, but if you miss the fun, here are some fun ways brands pranked customers. Well, Olipop and Pringles teamed up jokingly to introduce sour cream and onion flavored soda. IKEA joined the fun, announcing an invisible collection like invisible shoe racks and laundry baskets. And Kraft Mac and Cheese teamed up with Fruity Pebbles for Fruity Mac. Well, you can stay up to date with all of the headlines and the latest weather on the News 4 app. Just look up WOAI in your app store. I'm Melissa Vega, and that's your News 4 Snapshot.